Mighty God, ever loving Father, we thank you for another preparation day as we prepare for the Sabbath. Help us to get it done. The night is coming down a little earlier now. Father God, we thank you for the Sabbath that is rolling on. Thank you for food, raiment, and shelter, for fair measure of health. Thank you, thank you, thank you for everything that you have done. In Jesus' precious name we pray. Amen. Yeah. Thinking me up in the right line as well as be on this line. I give you praise, Father, because you're worthy to be praised. I thank you for all the blessings of life, food, raiment, sunshine. Oh, a place to lay my head up you could drive my children, my grandchildren. Praise the Lord. My prayer line family members, I give you praise, Lord, because you set aside this preparation day where we can finish preparing for your holy Sabbath. Hallelujah. You for your holy Sabbath. Rest and sanctify. I thank you most of all for Jesus who died in my stead. So I can have this privilege to come calling you, Father. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Jesus. Thank you for my guardian angel who watches over me day and night. Thank you, Lord, for everything. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Loving Lord, everlasting Father, thank you for waking me up this morning. Yes. All right, my Lord, thank you for my children, for my grandchildren. Thank you for my family, Lord, and their children. Thank you for my prayer line partners, their family. Mm. Thank you for food on my table. Yes, my yes, table. yes. Coats on my back, Father. Thank you for guiding doctors in the direction that they need to go. Thank, Thank you, God. Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you for holding me. Father, let your will. I thank you for allowing your will to be done in my life. Father, thank you for preparations day as we prepare for the beautiful, wonderful Sabbath. Praise the Lord. Father, where we will spend just praise you, just praise your name, Lord. Thank you for the sun, the moon, the stars. Lord, mostly thank you for your son, Jesus Christ, whom you sent to die for us that we're able to be here. Glory, honor, and praises be unto you today oh, yes. and always. And it is in his name, Jesus Christ, our Lord, that I come before your throne and thank you for every second, every breath that I take, every move that I make, every traveling mercy, local and long distance. In Jesus Christ, I come before thee. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank you for waking me up in my right mind. Thank you, Lord. Yes. I pray for all my family members. We never could have made it without you. You brought us from a mighty long way. You've been a good God to all of us. So I just thank you for all what you've done for us. Thank you for letting me go to see my uh, son, uh, the one that died. Thank you for his his service today. Have and mercy. Thank you for enabling me to go to be with my family. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Lord, for all you've done for us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Hey, Amen. Praise the Lord. Uh, let me take this opportunity to thank the Lord <clears throat> for this precious moment. Indeed, God is good. Through this week, I thank the Lord. Yes, uh, through this week, I thank the Lord because my cow wanted, uh, he, he, uh, my car was in heat, and because God is really loving God, and he is our provider, I really prayed God to open me door so that I can get some financial, so that I can impregnate my car, but because God loves us, and he is our provider, he did it, and I did it, I impregnated the, my car because it was on uh, heat, I really thank the Lord, hallelujah. Praise the Lord, all right. All right, uh, Kim Munta. 
Kemunta. All right, we go on to Patricia. Uh, yes, I give thanks to God for everything He's doing to me. I was absent on prayer line because of my phone and my uh, my body, my pain, my health. May I thank God because He allowed me to come back to on my prayer line because I lose weight. Mercy. Not being prayer line. Thank God for everything He's doing for me. I know God loves me. I know God loves us. Hallelujah. Thank you for our prayer line. Thank him for my family. I thank him for uh, my children, my grandchild. I thank him for our brother Michael. You've got a praise. I thank him for everything. And I say, I have nothing else to say. Just thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Hey, man. Praise the Lord. All right, uh, Karuba. Yes. First of all, I want to thank God because my neighbor today gave me her phone to use. So I want to thank God. Praise the Lord. I like it to I like it. this day this week I am I like it to be online because you normally know I don't have my phone, my own phone, but I want to thank God for what he has done today. And also, secondly, I want to thank our Almighty God to be with my family. Even if we have the cough, me and my children, but my husband is good. Praise the Lord. God is a cure in my family. We have not taken any medicine, but I have seen God is working upon our life. And that day, I want to thank God for what he did last Saturday. I told you, pray for me. We were having a, a choir a competition. competition. Yes, we were seven churches, but we managed to be in position three out of seven. Hey, man. And I thank God because uh, I thank I thank God so much because on this, on October November we are going now for solo songs now. Hey, man. So hard. Continue to pray to pray for me because we are not yet complete the competition. Amen. Praise the Lord. We'll keep on praying. Uh, all right. Yes. God is awesome. Uh, Sister Lynette. Yes. I also want to take this opportunity to thank our God for what He's doing unto us as a team of prayers in this prayer line. I thank God for Michael, who he organizes all the time without getting tired. I give glory for that. <laughs> for Have mercy. I thank God for enabling me to get this opportunity to to join the prayer line. Sometimes I'm so much busy, but today God has made it. Amen. The I thank God for he has been providing for us food. We have not lacked I thank God that uh, my daughter was feeling unwell because of tonsils, and we, I have been praying for it, and I know that some of you have been praying for it also. She is well now. I Praise the God. Lord. Amen. Dismas? Yes, let me take this opportunity to thank God for this preparation day. Also to thank God for the miracle. I saw one of the other day when I was teaching the first years about sin and forgiveness. I thank God for the teachings are keeping changing more people unto Christ's family, winning more souls. Be I thank God for that. Also thank God for the provision of food. Right now, I thank God. Uh, today, we are going to receive some lies from the conference. I thank God for that. Amen. So with that, I give God honor. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Uh, Jacob? So, uh, 
I thank God for this opportunity that He has given us and uh, brought to us from that. We appreciate for our family that He has just the security on us. And He is providing as we just pray and just uh, asking Him that He will be just with you and use you that you are trying to assist more people. I appreciate that He is using you and more others. I pray He will continue with us. Amen. Uh, Edwin? Edwin? Yes. All right, quickly. Uh, I thank God for the great care on our family and also in our church. We have been doing this stuff. Forgiven as our sin, as our already surrendered their life, and they are ready to receive a baptism coming. Oh, praise the Lord! December. Yes. So I pray for my mom, who is uh, admitted in hospital from diabetic and uh, pressure. Have mercy. Thank you. Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Williams. I've been blessed to see another day. Thank you for life, health, and strength. We have been clothing. Lord, thank you for bringing us together on this prayer line. There's one to give praise and worship your holy name. Lord, thank you for bringing us safety through another week, the Father. Lord, we've seen all the natural disasters, the Father, everything that's going on, the Father, but yet you saw fit to keep. Yes, that's alive. Hallelujah. Keep us safe, the Father. For that, we are so grateful, the Father. But I just want to thank you so much for your Holy Sabbath day, for that day of rest. We can just uh, come together and just rejuvenate from all the different cares of the week, the Father. Lord, thank you for for uh, everything you continue to do in our past, the Father, for keeping us safe on these dangerous roads, the Father. Thank you for watching over my son and keeping him safe each and every day as he goes to college, the Father. Thank you for watching over my mom, the Father, for continuing to just... Praise the Lord. Each and every day. Lord, you know her pains, her aches, you know the the issues with the blood pressure, but Lord, you see fit to keep her going. So Lord, for that, so thankful the Father. Lord, we love you. Thank you and praise your holy name. In Jesus' name I do pray. Amen. Okay. I thank God for the gift of life, gift of food, shelter that he had given unto us, unto me, unto my family. I thank God for the gift of the family of this prayer line. Praise God. God. For the connection he made me to meet you, Brother Michael. Give God a praise. And meet also my brothers and sisters in this prayer line. It has really become a blessing sent to my family. Like, it has really engaged our faith. It has really strengthened our, strengthened our faith. Also, it has really uplifted us as a family. I thank God for that. Because the teachings and everything that we do in this prayer, the prayer, the prayers, they have really helped my family. I thank God for that. Thank God for my father. Thank God for my mom. I thank God for everything. Yes. It's unmentionable. I can't mention all. I thank God for the for this day, the preparation day, may he continue being with us forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. All right. I love the Lord. Praise that exceeds our strength and our will. Younger covered his mouth, how poor. Yes. There were blood and of the land was still. Loveless, infinite, matchless grace really bestowed on all who believe you that are longing to see his face. Will you this moment his grace? Yes, yes, yes. Grace, grace, God, grace. Oh, praise grace the Lord. Will pardon and cleanse within. Grace, grace, God, grace. Grace that is greater than all. 
Yes, hallelujah. Sin and despair, like the sea waves cold, threaten the soul with infinite love. Grace that is greater, yes, grace untold, points to the refuge, the mighty cross. Grace, grace, God's grace, grace that will pardon and cleanse within. Grace, grace, God's grace. Grace that is greater than all our sin. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I know my time was already far spent, but I'm going to do my best. Y'all pray for me. Uh, I, I want to give God thanks to my beautiful wife and my children. I thank God for you. Praise ye the Lord. All right, um, Father God, help that the, I, I say the right things in this devotional. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, so the devotional, the topic is, God is the beginning, the end, and everything in between. <laughs> so that's why they say God is. And, and, and you could fill in the blank when it comes to God. They say, who is the beginning and the ending of everything? And I just gave you the answer. And the answer is who? God is. He was around when nothing existed. That's our God. Praise the Lord. They say, who is the genesis of the Old Testament and the revelation of the New God is. Praise the Lord. They say, what does Alpha and Omega mean? I'm going to wait for the answer. All right. Beginning the, the beginning and the end. But really, that's what people say all the time. But Alpha and Omega really means the first and the last letter, I want you to get this, because a lot of times people say the beginning and the end. And that's that's right. But it was drafted from it being the first and the last letter in which alphabet? Nobody want to answer? In the Greek alphabet. All right, in the Greek alphabet. I know somebody said, wow, I didn't know that. But that's what it is. All right. Um, who fulfilled all hopes and aspirations uh, for us? God does. And even though sometimes we complain a lot, we don't have this or we don't have that. But, but by the mere fact that we have breath, that we can complain, that is a wonderful thing that God has already done for us. Uh, do we serve a God who is able to grant all our needs? And I know somebody on the line might say, but I'm hungry. But you're alive to, to say that you're hungry. And that's a good thing. Praise the Lord, because there is hope for those who are alive. They say, is Christ the past, present, and the future? Yes, he is present in all that. He was present, he is present, and he will be present forever. Praise the Lord. Is Christ still in control? As we look at the chaos in this world, I want somebody to answer that. Is he still in control? Yes, but we see chaos in this world because sin is present in this world. Will Christ come soon to restore his world 
to its perfect symmetry? And the answer is yes. And it says, who, who, who created the heaven and the earth in the beginning? God is the one who created. It says here, He is our beginning, our end, and everything that is between those two points. We can trust that He has everything under control. I, I, I know sometimes it looks like, I mean, we just experience, I mean, it, 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 we had the rain, but we did not have all that goes with it, like the, you know, the ripping down of the houses and all this stuff. But sometimes we say, oh my God, if God is in control, why would he allow that to happen? And I'm sure he, it, it happened to all the people who was in the path of Elin. All right. Let us give God the praise in spite of what takes place. Praise ye the Lord.